Are you tired of waiting for your Excel formulas to calculate? If you're using Excel wings and finding that your user-defined functions are taking forever to refresh, you're not alone. Today, we're going to explore how to speed up those UDFs in Excel. I completely understand your frustration. Waiting 25 seconds for a formula to refresh, especially when it's called over 4,000 times, can feel like an eternity. You're definitely not the only one facing this issue. Let's dive into the specific question at hand. One user asked why their Excel Wings UDF is so slow compared to Excel's built-in functions. They provided an example formula and mentioned that even with optimized connection settings, the performance is lacking. Sound familiar? Let's find out why this is happening. So, what's causing this slowdown? When using UDFs in Excel, each call to the function can introduce overhead, especially when called repeatedly. This is where array formulas can come to the rescue, allowing you to process data in bulk rather than one cell at a time. Stick around because later in this video, I'll share a powerful workaround that can significantly improve your UDF performance. You won't want to miss it. To improve the speed of Excel Wings user-defined functions, or UDFs, the user should consider using array formulas. This method allows for processing multiple values at once rather than calling the function repeatedly for each cell. The user can modify their existing UDF to accept ranges as inputs. This way, the function can compute results for an entire array in a single call, significantly speeding up the calculations. Next, the user should ensure that they are using optimized connection settings in Excel Wings. This can help reduce the overhead of communication between Excel and Python. Additionally, the user can check if they are using the latest version of Excel Wings. Updates often include performance improvements and bug fixes that can enhance speed. Finally, if the user still experiences slow performance, they might consider rewriting the logic in a more efficient way or using built-in Excel functions where possible, as these are typically faster. Fun fact! Did you know that using array formulas can sometimes make your Excel calculations faster than a speeding bullet? Well, maybe not that fast, but you get the idea. Now, let's look at the answers provided by other users. An alternative approach to improve the speed of Excel Wings UDFs is to use array formulas. This method allows you to process multiple values at once, significantly enhancing performance. Additionally, leveraging Pandas can provide further speed improvements. The user also mentions that tools like PyXL and Flying Koala can be beneficial for achieving speedups in Excel calculations. Now, let's dive into a different answer from another user. An alternative approach to improve the speed of Excel Wings UDFs is to use Excel Oil. This tool connects Excel and Python with minimal overhead, making calculations much faster. When using Excel Oil, you can call your function on large ranges and it will execute almost instantaneously. Just ensure that your Excel and Python versions match in bitness. Let's take a look at an answer from another user. An alternative approach to improve the speed of Excel Wings UDFs is to consider using PIXLL instead. PIXLL is an add-in that embeds Python directly into Excel, which significantly reduces the overhead of communication between Python and Excel. PyXLL is reported to be much faster than Excel Wings, especially for NumPy operations, as it runs Python in the Excel process itself. However, keep in mind that PyXLL is not free software. Here's the key takeaway. Whenever possible, use array formulas instead of calling UDFs multiple times. This simple change can save you a lot of time and frustration. And there you have it. By switching to array formulas, you should see a significant improvement in your Excel performance. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe for more tips and tricks to enhance your Excel experience.